Howdy. This video is intended to support 4-H members interested in participating in the photography contest and we're going to look at cropping and resizing a JPEG image using IrfanView. So let's take a look at the software. IrfanView is a free shareware software that you can download from IrfanView.com. Uh, for the purpose of this video, we're going to be using version 4.33. It's important to remember that uh, most of the more current versions are very similar in format. So let's get started with the photo. First, we want to open our original image. Uh, this would be a high quality image that we take directly from our camera. And so here's our image. We want to, we're going to do both uh, cropping and resizing at the same time. So first thing we want to do is click on edit up in the toolbar. Then we want to create a custom crop selection. This is going to give us a box that will show us. Uh, for an 8 by 10, it's a 4 to 5 ratio, width to height ratio. We're actually going to crop, this is a landscape photo, but we're going to crop it to look a, like a portrait photo. So we'll put 4 to 5, we'll put 850 in the height, which is the longer end, the 680, the width will change automatically. The DPI, we want to set to 300. And then we click on Save and Apply to the image. What this does is it gives us a little box, if you can notice that in the top left hand corner. What you want to do is put your cursor on the line, hold the control key down, and click and hold the left mouse button. Drag it to the maximum size of the box. Notice it's staying in proportion to 8 by 10. When you're done, right click and hold. Move the box to the desired location and let go of the right mouse button. That's the image that you're going to crop and resize. So now we've made that selection. You click on Edit in the toolbar. You click on Crop Selection. And now you have your 8x10 proportion photo cropped with the other stuff out. So first thing we want to do is save it with a different file name. So we'll go File, Save As. We're going to change the file name from the original. This one, for the purpose of this example, is going to say Resized and Cropped. I'll draw your attention to the box in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Uh, I want to make sure that you slide this bar all the way to the far right to good or 100%. All the other defaults should pretty much remain the same. Then just click on save. Don't forget to remember what location or, or folder that you save this file in. So here's our photo. We're going to open the new file. Notice up in the uh, file up the top left hand side it says resized and cropped. So let's look at what our what, what is our photo or our image right now. So we'll pull up the uh, information, image information. Uh, don't get the pixels confused with the size of the file in terms of megabytes. So if you look a little further down, it'll tell you where it says disk size. It'll say 1.08 megabytes, which is well within the two megabyte limitation for entry requirements. Also you'll notice the 4 by 5 in terms of inches, that's our proportion, 4 inches to 5 inches equivalent to an 8 by 10, and our DPI is set at 300 by 300. So we click OK. So this image as it currently exists is well within the size for entering the photography contest.